hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys i'm going to guide you how to use the external usb sd card or any other card on, on the mac so first of all you need to plug in the usb correctly on your port and once you plugged in you should be able to see the usb port here and the usb device here so let me remove it so i have removed it you can also change the port here and once you change the port it should be detected here like this if it is not detecting here we can go to the finder and see if you are able to access your external usb here sd card or the external card here or not if it is also still not showing up let me close the finder then go to the finder options then click on settings sometime if these options are disabled like external disks this should be on like this and also go to the general and make sure the external disk is tick here as you can see here it has been disappeared if i click on it it is showing up here so this is the general behavior of using the external usb or the external hard drive and the sd card if the device is still not showing up there could be some issue physical hardware issues with your usb and also you can troubleshoot this issue by going to this launch pad and once you go to the launch pad guys let me show you you need to go to the other option and then you need to open the disk utility and check out here if the external hard drive or ssd is showing up here you can see external is showing up here so check its file system in my case the fat32 is compatible with windows as well as in the mac so if it is the fat32 or xfat it means that it will be compatible with the mac os if it is the ntfs then there could be other issue on your mac device while you connecting that so in this case guys you need to erase the all the data from the usb and make sure you format the expat and click on erase but before clicking on erase all the data will be lost from the usb so make sure you you need to back up all the data from the external hard drive or the ssd just select them and drag them to the desktop and later on you can back up the data after is erasing the data from the usb so i hope guys this video is helpful for you uh, if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching